to the lion's den. Lalo Alvarez has always been on performance enhancement. In a second, I'm going to show you a little short clip of what Clambucho can do for you and where does it come from. But Canelo Alvarez, you can arguably argue that he has been using performance enhancement. Let's have a look. Realmente, demasiados cuidados, creo que extremo, no al, al extremo de no comer carne. Begins here. The consumption of clambuterol via tainted meat. This is the business of cattle doping. Clambuterol was originally developed for the treatment of animals with respiratory issues. It was considered unsafe by health experts due to its potential side effects, which include heart palpitations, tremors, and nervousness, and was eventually banned. But it's being used for a very different purpose. The use of clambuterol is to reduce the engorda. So, less time, more resources. The process begins at the cattle's consumption. Clambuterol is a pill that is pulverized and then added to the animal's food in a dosage of 10 micrograms per kilogram per cow for two to three months. This is known as the fattening period, and it's not regulated by authorities. The average person is not affected by this, but for athletes who are regularly tested, any trace of clambuterol, a banned substance, can result in penalization. Several Mexican athletes have tested positive for the substance in recent years. The most famous of them all, Saul Canelo Alvarez, who had 0 0.06 nanograms of clambuterol in his system. Estaba comiendo en restaurantes, comiendo, haciendo mi vida normal en Guadalajara. Llegó Bada tres veces en una semana. Me hice las pruebas normal. A los dos o tres días me habla gente de Golden Boy. Saul, saliste positivo en una prueba de de Bada. Entonces. No sabía por dónde, o sea, dije, pero ¿cómo? O sea, deben de estar equivocados porque no, eso no puede ser posible. Leí y me di cuenta el problema de, de, de la carne en México. Although Alvarez's test yielded a very small amount of clambuterol in his system, that banned substance cost him a six-month suspension a few weeks before his acclaimed rematch against Gennady Golovkin, which would have taken place on May 5th. Eso fue una responsabilidad mía de alguna manera, ¿no? Pero nunca lo hice intencionalmente, nunca hice, ni, ni me he metido, ni necesito de sustancias prohibidas para que me ayude una pelea. Though the amounts of clambuterol in meat are generally small traces, when taken in repeated dosages, they can benefit an athlete. It helps with the retention of lean muscle mass. So this is what athletes want when they're, when they're training. It opens the air passageways and makes it easier to breathe. It accelerates your metabolic rate. It's a central nervous system stimulant, so it makes you have quicker reaction time. So there are many, many benefits of using clenbuterol for a professional boxer. Now that we heard from the doctors what clenbuterol can do for you, it gives you a quick reaction. It opens your uh, airways. You know, you it, it, you can fight a, uh, a lot longer, a lot longer than uh, someone that isn't using a uh, clambutro or any uh, performance enhancement. But there you go, there you go, man. At the end of the day, Canelo Alvarez, you have to hold him accountable. You know, if I don't do it, who will? Even the doctor said it. The doctor said it, man. But yeah, that's all I got for you guys. See you on the next one. Peace.